What is up guys, it is your boy Jay and if you wasn't here for last season, here's how January goes. It's transfer window, so we'll try and sell some players, loan out some players. I got one attacking mid in mind that I do want to sign, but otherwise I'll see you guys at the end of the transfer window. We are done with January and let me tell you something right now, right? We lost nothing, which means that we've gotten through in the Johnston Paint, uh, John, no, Papa John's Trophy. I call it the Johnston Paint Trophy because that's what I remember as a kid. And the FA Cup, which means that, ladies and gentlemen, we have got some cup games. And I am going to play said cup games like this. Uh, this must be a Papa John's. Yeah, so we could actually, no, we don't need to play the Papa John's actually. But we will play the FA Cup game against Everton. That's going to be... An upset if we tried. Scott Dan is... Oh, Fe no, Theodore Dan is wanted by Derry City. Fine by me. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Uh, Presley actually ended his loan. So we needed a new striker. So, ladies and gentlemen, may I introduce to you, and I don't know how we pulled this off, the new striker to JFC. His name is Matthias Tell from Bayern Munich. He joins on loan until the end of the season. Which means this dude is going to be a bit necessary when it comes to um, these types of games. So if I get the B team out for this one, because I got a feeling that the B team is really, really going to actually be necessary for this game. If I can find him. Yeah, here he is. I'm going to say he's not going to be on like out on international duty or something. So we should be all right. Um, give me two seconds on this. I'm trying to think. Here we go. Yep. All right. That's the team. We're going to play against Ipswich. I don't care about the league at this point, so if they beat us, that's fine. Yep, that's actually completely fine. Most of our team now is just mainly make sure that the crucial first team players don't get upset and that we can just carry on. Right. Johnston paint trophy time. Let's do a little bit of a match interview. Again, uh, we got to be very happy and very confident going into a trophy that we have never won before. So it would be nice to play a game of the Johnston Paint Trophy at some point. Four team is out against Stockport. Can we do it? Yes, we can. We are through to the semi-finals of the Papa John's Trophy. So things are extremely kicking off here at JFC. All right, we can play a full lineup going into this one because we don't need to worry. And it is a 1-1 draw, which I'm not all too worried about, but we'll be all right. Right. Um, yeah, so the rest of these we have to play, which is Rotherham, Bristol Rovers, and an away trip to our very first Premier League ground, which will be... Um, the stadium they use for the Olympics. So with us in the playoff spots, let's get to the game against Rotherham. Burke, easy enough, one nil. He somehow got through all the defenders, two nil. Two on Rotherham. Three one, what my boy, finally getting back into form. Lovely to see it. All right, 3-1 half time. Let's get it. Oh, what a goal. Oh, before 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 we uh, make the changes and just end the game. I need to see that goal back. I need to see that goal back. 
So where does Watt come from? Because he just puts it in right in the back of the net. No issues. All right, we're going to make our changes. Uh, that's not what I wanted to do. That's what I wanted to do. So is this, uh, this, this, and tell you can have a go out too, buddy. Come on. Let's, because most of you will have to play in the next game because I need to rest as many players as I can because I need to uh, win the FA Cup. Well, I'm not going to try and win the FA Cup. That's a bit of a stretch. Uh, try and do well in the FA Cup. I want a decent FA Cup run. So let's get to the game against Bristol Rovers. Wow, we actually have the lead. Tell getting his first goal. Again, I'm not sure if he scored before, but that is definitely his first goal with us playing with Tell. But it was a great through ball over to Tell, and he just slaps it back in the net. 1 0. Oh, what a brilliant slotted goal. 2 0. Tell. Right, not only has he got a hat trick, but he's ended the game with within half an hour. Within half an hour, the game is over. So let's just uh, simulate to the end. 4-0. Oh, okay, we've only made one change and Silver scored. Oh, the youngster Silver. Okay, fantastic news. Absolutely fantastic news coming out of League One. Uh, I don't know where that puts us, but um, William Payne. Who's William Payne? Did I forget to do the monthly squad before? Oh, I did. Oh, okay. Uh, there's nobody here. Nobody here. Nobody here whatsoever. So, ladies and gentlemen, let's go to London Park. Or is it London Stadium? Where are we playing? London Stadium for the round of 16 against West Ham United. Nothing happened so far. Nil nil. Right, well, we walk out of London with a draw. Not exactly the best result that we could have got, but that means we actually. There's extra time. Okay, extra time it is. Please get that through. Oh my god, what a ball. It's in! It's in! Andrew Chelsea is in! Andrew Chelsea! Yes! Come on! We've done it! We've done it! We don't even need the penalties! We don't even need the penalties! Andros Townsend has scored the winner against West Ham United! I thought it would have gone to a replay, but it is finally done! What a through! What a ball straight through the town's end and he just slams it in. <laughs> okay, come on. Come on, we got this. We can do this. Auto defensive. Yeah, come on, come on. Just tackle, just tackle. I don't care. Give him a yellow, I don't care. 
Just defend this now. Defend this. This is the last shot. Defend this. Boot it. It's done. League One, JFC has beaten West Ham United in extra time. Oh my God, we bought out those strikers so we wouldn't need to do this. I thought it would have gone to penalties. That's why we bought all the wingers and strikers on. But no, we beat West Ham United 1-0 in extra time. And hopefully we get an easier opponent so we could actually have a chance at maybe going to Wembley. Like Huddersfield. I could beat Huddersfield. I could beat Huddersfield. So go on, give us Huddersfield. I would love Huddersfield. All right, just a couple of questions for you. I don't care if I go to Wembley and lose. I just want to have a game at Wembley. I know we probably will anyway. Because of the Papa John's trophy. But you never know how many times we can go to Wembley. Right, we've just got monthly squad report. Who are you? No. No. Let's just, let's just get rid of all of these first. Brilliant result. Absolutely brilliant result. I'm happy for the whole club. I am honestly happy about the about the whole thing. Why? You know what? I need to call you up, dude. I think you could actually get some game time now that we have as many games as possible. Right, so where where are we in the league League One table? We are currently sitting in second. So Rotherham have completely screwed up their chances and we're now back in second place. Right. Uh presuming everything's done, who do we have? For the first time in JFC history on FIFA 23, Leicester City, a Premier League club, will be coming down to Little Osa Scribe Park for a quarterfinal game. So we got another Premier League game and we do have the semi-finals of the Papa John's Trophy against Stevenage, so it's all kicking off here. But ladies and gentlemen, thank you all so much for watching. Please remember to like, comment, subscribe and peace.